Hi everybody, what's going on? <laughs> YouTube, what's good? Simple's not here, back again with another video. And this is going to be another prediction preview yes. prediction video of this year's Money in the Bank. Yes. From Boston, Mass. And we know who's winning. Garden. No, we don't. Okay. No, we do okay. not. But, um, yeah, let's get right down to it. So, first out in the pre-show, we don't really get a pre-show match. No, because, because they haven't even announced it. No, because Daniel Bryan is supposed to make, um, is supposed to address the WWE oh. Universe about his condition. And by the way, you know, the guy's saying, you know, if, you have, if I'm stripped of these titles, then that would ruin everything that I've been working up to for these past few years, the past few months. You're not going to take them away. And then they just take it away. They're All cool. scaring. They don't even show them. Gave him the titles and just take it away. Yeah. No explanation. That that thing just went out the window. Pretty much. So this is gonna be interesting to see what he says. Dates and venues, looking it up. Do, 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 do. Oh, let's let's just get right down to this match. Rusev versus Big E. <laughs> I don't oh, know. you you mean uh, Big E the preacher? Yeah. Father Father uh, Devon? Uh yes, Reverend Devon. Yeah, Reverend Devon. Oh Devon. Stuff. I was like, America is the greatest stuff. What am I wrong? That pro on Monday. Didn't see it. <laughs> oh, I gotta show you it afterwards. Didn't see it. Oh, you gotta see this. <laughs> He's a freaking. <laughs> I didn't see it, no. <laughs> Must be great. Oh it, no, it was so bad. His promo sucked, but he sounded like a preacher that you see in church. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. It's like America is the greatest. So it's like so it's like one of those uh, things you'd see in coming to America. <laughs> yeah. Like yeah no, no, no. They base his they base his promo off of the preacher from coming to America. Oh. <laughs> wow. Genius. Oh, that was so hilarious. Genius. But Rusev's winning anyway. Yeah, Rusev <laughs> all the way. Yeah. Um, we get a Divas match. Not for the Divas title. This one is not for the Divas title. What? Summer Rae versus Layla with Fandango as the special guest referee. <laughs> Why is this a match? Because it is. Is this a total Divas thing? No. I don't think so. It, it must be. Why well, was that the only... Because Summer Rae isn't she still on Total Divas? Yes. Well, then, uh, that's people, probably why. Yeah, people don't like her on there. That's probably another reason why. Because well, they're trying to make her the villain of the show, so they're trying to make her win or do all that stuff. But she's playing a baby face, isn't she? Kind of. She's playing the baby face know. in we this. Don't. She's playing the baby face in this match, but she's a heel in the show. In real life, next day. yeah. In real life, unfortunately, yes. Not unfortunately, she doesn't have a face. She doesn't have the face like a Tori Wilson or a Kelly Kelly. She looks like. She looks like somebody you don't want to like. Eh, okay. But who you got in this one? I don't Either care. One. I don't care. Fandango wins. Yeah, he's the referee. Yeah, he wins. So he's going to be in a little of a sandwich and he's going to be rolled on. To, 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 yeah. No, that's PG. They can't do that. The kids oh, are like, Mommy, what, what are they doing? <laughs> exactly. The, the, the Fandango wins. I'm picking Layla. Yeah. Knocks both of them. I'm picking Layla. I don't care. Um... Ryback Axel, Ryback and Curtis Axel versus Goldust and Stardust. Oh, the Crusaders. <laughs> what do you think about Stardust? Uh, First of all, what do you think about Stardust? That's a failure. I love it. They're just trying to keep Cody on the roster because they don't want to re release him. I love Stardust. Oh, that's it. <laughs> when you wish upon a star. Oh, God. It's breathtaking. Oh, <laughs> oh. Yes. No, that was bad. That was bad. Maybe. No one in the audience was saying, responding at all. They were just like, okay, when's the Cena coming out? Oh. But, um, yeah, Ryback still isn't really that much of a, anything no. either. They're just keeping Ryback around until just in case they need Goldberg a back, They in. just need a backup baby face. They, at least they have Ryback. They could do the Phoebe Moore things again. Or when Goldberg comes in. Or Goldberg's never coming in. No. No. He's never doing another match. I'm picking the um, Dust Brothers. Of course. Because they beat them <laughs> two, again. Monday, two Mondays ago. And they're going to do it again. Yeah. It's just going to be awkward. All right. Next up is the Divas Championship match. Paige oh, we have two Divas matches? Uh-huh. Oh, my God. Can you believe that? Uh, no, I can't. Well, you better believe it because it's happening. This one's for the Divas title. Paige versus Naomi. 
Just give it to Naomi. Yeah? Give it to the more talented I man. agree. I, I, give I, it to the more talented man. Give it to Naomi, and then her and Cameron can um, fight it out. And then that's going to be another Total Divas That'll thing. Be another total you know, divas. This is all leading up to Total Divas. Pretty much. This is, total Divas is basically going to take over the Divas division. That's unfortunate. Yes. That show totally should be gone, long and gone. I don't know. I, that, I, that show sucks. I'm entertained by no, it. No, it sucks. I like and it. And now the fact that they're putting it on the network means that they're not going to put it on the E! Network. Anymore. It's not going to be on the E! Network anymore. No, the, no I have a feeling that the E! Network's going to say, fuck this show. It but is, what about the ratings, though? It's the, the ratings. It's going count. down. No, it's the ratings, ratings are, are down. Oh, they're going down are fast. Sweeps. People are... T people are t sweeps is... The, no. <laughs> people are tired of this show. And the E! Network's going to say, fuck this. And then they're going to take it off the show, and then they're going to put it on the network. They're not going to have any choice. Whatever. Um, I don't care. I don't either. Um, now we get uh, the... Let's go for the tag team title match. Oh, there's a, uh, how many matches are on this? There game? are seven so far. Oh, so far. I so far. Think they're going to throw, like, gonna um, throw Santino and Adam Rose in there, and they're going to do like a comedic tag team thing. And then it's like, and even when even Stone Cold says, I don't understand what this Adam Rose character is. No, no. Even Stone Cold doesn't get it. Yeah. Which is a shame. Um, no, I'm not ashamed. It's a good thing, actually. The Usos against the Wyatt family for the tag team championships. Give it to the Wyatt family. Agreed. Give they it need to, the to be the family. heel tag team that, that's the dominant force that beats everybody. And then it ultimately comes down to them facing uh, Ascension. No, they need the dominant heel um, stable. Dominating oh. heel stable. Yeah. And it starts with the Harper and Rowan getting the tag titles. I yeah. Think. Oh, yeah. They got. They better win. If they don't, then the Wyatt family is done. Yeah. They are officially done. All right. Cena buried them. The Usos buried them. And they're just done with them. They got nothing God. else for them. God. All right. Um, the first of two Money in the Bank ladder matches. This is for the contract. The traditional the Money case. in the Bank ladder match for the briefcase. You got Bad News Barrett, who, who might might be in it, might, depending if he's hopefully not Hopefully he is. Hopefully we'll he find is. out he's tomorrow. Um, Dean Ambrose, Seth Rollins, Dolph Ziggler, Jack Swagger, Kofi Kingston, and Rob Van Dam. All right, let's break this down. They're not giving it to RVD. No. They're not giving it to Kofi Kingston. <laughs> Unfortunately. They're not giving it to Ziggler. No. Because, as we have learned... The reason why they don't push him as hard he's is because... Not, he's not too good in the Because head. they are... No, because they're afraid that he's going to be at risk for more concussions. Exactly. He's not road. right in the head. Yeah, exactly. So they're not putting it on him. Nope. So that leaves Barrett... Swagger. Dang. <laughs> I, that, no. no. I don't see that. I Barrett. think he's going to do a feud with Rusev. Uh, yeah. I think... If Barrett is still in it, I could see it giving it to them. Yes. Giving it to him. That's Because he actually pick. has a character. He's my pick to win it all because yeah. he is... But, that's, but the whole plans may change now. But they might have to put Big know. Show in. Oh, God, no. Yeah, because that's their backup plan. If Barrett's not going to be in there, they need a giant in a ladder match, and that's the Big Show. Or Mark Henry. Oh. So... Anyway. But Seth Rollins or Dean Ambrose? I think they're going to give it to Rollins. Rollins, it means more because he's part of the authority now. He's got the briefcase. They're going to push this to where it's like, this is our chosen one. He's got the briefcase. And then sometime in the next year, he's going to be the world champion. So Ugh. be prepared. Because this is best for business. <laughs> exactly. I'm picking Bad News Barrett, even if he isn't in there. Even if he is, if he if he is in there, I'm picking him. If it's not him, I'm gonna go with Seth Rollins also. Okay. Now we get to the actual main event. Obvious. Obvious. Who's winning this one? No, it's not. Yes, it is. If you've seen what they did at Amazon and how they spoiled SummerSlam, you know what this is gonna be. But you don't know. They could change their plans. Oh, they're gonna um, have to now because they found out it was spoiled. Yes, that's a good thing. Uh, Del Rio, Alberto Del Rio. Bray Wyatt, Cesaro, John Cena, Kane, Randy Orton, Roman Reigns, and Sheamus ladder match for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. Okay, they're not giving it to Sheamus. He's not World Championship material. He used to be, but he fell off the horse. No, no, they, they, they fell off the horse. No, they screwed him over when they put it on him in the first place. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, they're not giving it to uh, Kane. Kane. They're not giving it to Kane. He's no. too old. Yeah. He shouldn't even be. He should be retired by now. No, there's no way in hell there is. No. Money. No, no, Del Rio's going out soon. 
Because he's in his 40s now. Uh -huh. um, let's see. The, who are the or other ones? Orton, mm -hmm. Cesaro, uh -huh. Cena, and Wyatt. Okay. They're not giving it to Cesaro because Cesaro needs still time to you know, establish himself as a Damn. baby face. Because he's because people want to cheer him and they refuse to turn him heel and they refuse to turn him babyface. King of Swing. Yeah, he's but, got a uh, thing going. But they're for not him. going. They're not going to put it on Bray Wyatt because uh, look, listen, who is he going to face at SummerSlam? If Brian. he's the, no, if Brian's not ready by SummerSlam and there's probably there's probably those things that he's not going to recover in two months. Who is he going to face? Big Show. That would suck. No. And I, no, no. Yes, it would. The fans are gonna crap all over it, just like they crapped all over the Big Show Randy Orton. What about why Cesaro? They're not gonna do that because they have to turn Cesaro babyface, and they're not doing that with Paul Heyman on his side. Mm, I don't know. Yeah, so but they I'm can't, picking him either way. Yes, they can't go with Wyatt. I'm picking this, Wyatt. This, unless they do another Wyatt Cena feud, and they have Cena win the title. Because here's what's happening: okay. Cena's winning the belt. And then he's going to feud against Randy Orton at Payback. Mm. Because, or Randy Orton wins his head Payback. Oh, I, I, I mean Battleground. Battleground. Uh, Battleground, my bad. But it's, yeah, okay, yeah, here's how I see it going down two ways. John Cena wins the belt. He faces Randy Orton at Battleground. Then he faces Brock Lesnar for the belt at SummerSlam. Or Randy Orton wins the belt at Money in the Bank. Mm -hmm. Then he faces Cena at Battleground. Cena wins. And then it's Cena, Brock at SummerSlam. Nope. That's the only way. Cena, Brock Lesnar is the main event at SummerSlam this year. There is no doubt that is happening. Brock Lesnar is the top heel of that company. Cena is the top babyface. You need to put those two together, and Brock's got to win the belt. Yep. He, 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 and there's and there's no way that's that's going to make Brock Lesnar look like a tough shooter badass than to have him beat Cena. Yep. That's the only way uh -huh. that's happening, and it's got to be for the belt. If it's not for the belt then it means nothing. Anything at WrestleMania, and if he loses, everything Even is out nothing. There. That is nothing. That's the only way it goes down. Reason why I'm picking Bray Wyatt is because, like we said, we need a dominant heel group. We need a dominating heel group. We the, did. Yeah, but then Cena did. came and beat them. Yeah, they did. But we, they got to reestablish themselves with um, Harper and Rowan getting the tag titles and Bray Wyatt getting the... World heavyweight. Well, champion. they don't need the world titles. They can just beat Sheamus and get the United States title. Yeah, they but could say, no. yeah, I'm your American champion. I represent America. No. I am the American champion. Follow me, America. We will take the world by storm. He could do something like that. He's got the like whole that. world in his hands. Yeah. Or the Intercontinental Belt. No. I say go because big. Because if, if, go big wait, all if Bad News Barrett is really injured and he can't compete, then he's got to drop the Intercontinental Belt. So they'll put it on Bray Wyatt. That's the way I see it going down. He's I not say, doing world titles. I say not go, yet. Go, he's go. not ready for world titles. Yeah, they really care about this guy. They're not going to put the world belts on him. He's they fine. done it with Sheamus. They did it with Del Rio. And look where their careers he's are. Fine. The Miz, he's fine. The Miz, same thing. I think he's ready. <laughs> we said that about all three. The Miz. The Miz was not ready. No, they. The people were like, "The Miz is ready. We want to see him world champion. No. He's entertaining. He's exciting. We already see him as he United States champion." And then they were like, "Okay." And then he got all that publicity and all Nothing. that stuff is like the first reality star being the champion and everyone was like oh my god and you know what a waste but anyway I, they're not putting the belt on him we'll see what happens well we will see what happens and yeah that's our review of money in the bank let us know what your predictions are down below and uh thank you joe for once You're again welcome. being a part of this yes uh, hopefully we'll do that for the um Review. Yeah, we'll review this one we'll, now. We will review this. Hopefully Lucas will be in there with us. Because <laughs> he said he wanted to be a part of it. Okay. So we will see if LC Muscles is here. But until my next video, this is Abe Hilzenani saying peace out, baby. See Bye, you guys, guys. next time.